Hello? Hi, Mom. You want to know how to do what? Hi, Mom. Keyboard repeat is when you hold down a key and it starts repeating, like this. It's not something you use a lot, but it can be handy when you want to put a visual divider in something you're writing by typing a row of dashes or X's or some other character. Some people find the defaults too slow, while others, often those with arthritis, would like to just turn it off. To change your keyboard repeat settings, just go to System Preferences, which you may have on your dock, but you can always find it up here in the Apple menu, and then go to the Keyboard section. Right on top, you'll see two settings, Keyboard Repeat Rate and Delay Until Repeat. Let's start with the Delay setting. Delay Until Repeat controls how long you need to hold down a key before it starts repeating. If you don't want any repeating, you can just slide this all the way to off and you're done. You won't get any repeats. Watch. I can hold this X down all day long and it'll only give me one X. But if you think you might like to use keyboard repeat sometimes, but you don't want it to kick in when you accidentally hold down a key too long, you'll probably like it set on the long side. Watch how long it takes to start up with it set to long. One, two, about at least two seconds. Now watch how quickly it starts up when I change it to short. If your fingers tend to rest on the keys a bit too long, you probably don't want it set to short or else your typing will look like this. <laughs> Once you decide how long you want the system to wait before starting to repeat, which I'll put it back here, then you can change how quickly you want it to repeat once it starts repeating. That you set over here with the key repeat rate. Actually, let me set this back to long so you can see the difference between the delay and the rate. So here's a slow repeat. I have no idea why anyone would want to set it this slow. And here's a fast repeat. See, long delay, but then fast repeat. Wow. <laughs> now, one important warning about setting it too fast. The keyboard repeat controls all the keys. That means the delete key too. So with a fast repeat rate, you have to be very careful you don't accidentally delete more than you wanted. Whoops, <laughs> like that. So play around with these two settings and see which combination works best for you.